So on the channel, we pretty much listen to the entirety of the Lovejoy discography. We listen to all of the Are You All Right EP. We listen to the entirety of Pebble Brain, the entirety of Wake Up and It's Over. We listen to their cover of the Baba Doobie tune. We listen to their cover of Privately Owned Spiral Galaxy. And we've listened to the acoustic stuff. We listen to the sloppy acoustic set with Tommy as well as the From Studio 4 EP. And now it's time to check out those scrapped songs from Lovejoy. Those being Cordado, Tomorrow, and Main Character Syndrome. Good morning, good afternoon, good night, depending on when you're watching this. How's it going, guys? First off, hope you're having a good day today. Hope your day's going well and hope it continues to go well. In case you missed any of my other Lovejoy reaction videos, I'll leave a full playlist link down in the description box below, as well as the playlist to the Wilbur Soot vi videos, in case you just want to see me react to the Wilbur Soot solo music as well. And... I will give you the warning going into this video. This is the second time I'm recording the intro, actually, because little did I know, the first time I recorded this, the media mod on my GoPro acted up where the microphone sounded like I was talking through a tin can. I'm going to try to fix the audio for the rest of this because it's 2 a.m. I don't want to re-record, plus the reaction would not be genuine. I'm about genuineness. I'm about that authenticity. So I'm going to fix it and the best that I can, and that's what you're going to be seeing here today. And hey, if you enjoy this type of content, maybe consider donating to the channel's Ko-Fi down in the description box below. Buy the boy a coffee, keep the boy sane, because oh boy, I need it after I'm going to get done editing the audio here. Without further ado, let's get into the scrapped Lovejoy songs. Let's go ahead and start off with Coronado. That's a nice bass drum sounds. Just nice and punchy. Ooh! Spicy. A little bit of spicy clash crunchy in there. Like that chord quality right there piques my interest because I'm like, ooh, crunch. It's crunchy, it's clashy. People may not like that, but I love it. I love crunchy, crunchy chords. Ooh, like a little hi hat break. Okay, hold on. That section right there, I love that. I love that because, like, it just breaks down. You get, like, some drums, then you get Ash doing the bass stuff, then you get, like, Wilbur doing this, like, that fast vocal line. Ooh. I need to listen. I love it. Love it so much. Ooh, ooh, then we get like soft. We get soft. This song is so cool. Why in the world did it get cut? Uh, uh, I did scroll through the comments before the, this video, and I did see someone say that Wilbur said that love. He thought love, Lovejoy fans wouldn't like it, but I love this. I lo I'm pretty sure everyone else would love this as well. Looks so good. But yeah, no, I love this. We'll love for them to revisit this in the future, eventually make it to a full, uh, its own studio recording. Because I love it. I think it'd be cool. You, you bring the 
Is that such a cool bass fill uh, between going changes? Not going to a hi hat, a halftime feel. Yeah, no, I love that. Absolutely love that so much. Like I said, the bridge is super cool as well, and I love it. Because, like, you, you have this, like, the, like, again, the drums, the guitar. I know in the, uh, earlier on I said j just the bass, just Ash doing the thing, but there is guitar in there, too. But, like, while we're doing the fast vocal line, the guitar doing, like, the staccato rhythm as well as the bass, as well as the drums is so good. Ah, I love it so much. Love Joy Wilbur. If for some reason you're watching this, you probably haven't seen any of my videos or so. Hello, hi. Uh, but revisit this, re record it, uh, give us a studio version, because I love it so much. I was it so much. But now I move to Tomorrow, which is a song I actually heard because it was the intro on the From Studio 4 EP. They start out with Tomorrow. However, this is the electrified version of it, not the acoustic version, which I've never heard. So. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh. No, I don't want to move on. I just want to live in this bass tone forever. Because it's such a cool bass tone, so deep. You add the chorus onto it. Uh, it's processed so well. Like... So good. Yeah, I just love the way this is building. Like the drums, the guitars, the trumpets in here. I, yeah, no, I love this. It just keeps on building. Keeps on building, keeps on building. It's such a cool thing. Like, it's like a long bridge in a song. It's like going up to that final chorus. Oh, dude. It's so good. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Oh, no, I want more. I want more of that. Like... What's funny is, like I said, it sounds like it's, just, it's a bridge building up to that last chorus. I could see this develop into a full song. Like, having a versus, having that be the bridge going to that final chorus. Oh, I need it. I need it. I need it, guys. But, no, I absolutely love Tomorrow. Great, great, great instrumental. I don't know if that... I don't know if that's why... I didn't look at the comments on that one. So I don't know if the reason why that was cut is because it was instrumental. But it should have been left in. It would have been a great, great intro to the Are You All Right EP. But now we move to main character syndrome. Here we go. This sounds familiar. You wake up in cold sweat. Hold on. Hold on. I need to check out something real quick. You wake up in Yeah, cold sweat. no. This is <laughs> This is it's always golden hour somewhere. 
they completely repurposed like the rhythm and kind of like the same chords too and it, nothing wrong with that at all nothing wrong with that at all but like ah oh, it's so cool it's so cool because like, you get to hear where things get taken from inspiration and stuff for other songs oh dude it's so cool so 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 so, so cool that's what you're into Party Trojan That's what you're into Call me once this petty respite Punch this fucker in his face He bits on tragic misappointments He smiles with only half his face It's not a problem, it's his niche It's classic signal series it's literally, it's always golden hour somewhere. What? It's, oh, that's so cool. Uh, I will say in that verse, I like the uh, backing vocals. Well, I don't necessarily understand. Because, like, there's a little bit of a weird phase thing in there where I can't exactly make out the words of those backgrounds. But, like, still, super cool. He bits on tragic misappointments He smiles with only half his face It's not a problem, it's his niche It's classic signaling theory Who's every step he takes It's laced with aspirations on his sleeve Socially Look the lead guitar line that's simple but effective Love it Again, Ash, bass tone, excellent as always. That's what you're into. Call me once this petty respite. Punch this fucker in his face. He bits on tragic misappointments. He smiles with only half his face. It's not a problem. Yeah, it's cool. It's super cool. Seeing like what was a thing turn it, and then you see what it gets turned into. Love it. Nah, super cool. Yeah, I love that. And I, it's weird for this one because, like, you know, with tomorrow as well as for uh, Cordato. Cor. No, that's not how you pronounce it. Coronado. Yeah, that's it. Uh, with those two, I'm like, yeah, no, I would love to see full versions of them. And for main character syndrome, it's weird, because if we got a full version of it, then we have, like, two different versions that's always going now or somewhere. But, then you could do them both live, mash them up into both of them, and it would be a fun transition and super, super fun. Like, that's fun. Oh, someone did put lyrics in the comment section wonderful whoever pay may pay 7174 is thank you very much and a l a r a l p a c e 1486 don't know how to pronounce your name posted the lyrics of cordado in the comment section of that and reading the, these lyrics as well as just thinking about that song that one is my favorite of the three cordado absolute love and I would love to see a full, full version of it. It's weird. I like main character syndrome as well. However, knowing that like it doesn't explicitly get turned into it's always going now or somewhere. It's just eerily similar. So maybe it did, maybe it didn't. Both have striking resemblances to me, so I don't know. Uh, but that like all these songs are good. All oh, these Lovejoy doesn't miss. Lovejoy doesn't miss. I can't think of a single song I don't like by them. All their songs are pretty good. I love it. Tomorrow's just instrumental, but still, it kills it as an instrumental. It's great. I love it. And yeah, let me know if there's any more scrapped, missing Lovejoy songs I don't know about. And who knows? Maybe those ones are live performances. I know people have said, hey, you should check out a couple of Lovejoy clips of them performing live on the channel, which, if you guys are interested in that, uh, let me know down in the comments, and I will uh, do one of these videos to a live performance of theirs. I know they posted the portraits of a blank slam on their YouTube channel live in Detroit, I want to say. But 
I'll check some things out if you guys want that. But anyway, I'll see you all on Monday with a 21 Pilots thing, Tuesday for Justin Listens to, and then we'll see you throughout the rest of the week. I'll see you all later. Goodbye. And good night, more importantly, have a good day, and I'll see you later.